How's it going everyone? Welcome to Block Unlocked and in today's video we're going to be playing Night in the Woods which is a game I've been wanting to get to for quite a while now actually. You know I've heard really good things about it but I actually haven't seen anything about the game itself so it's going to be completely new to me. Um, I'm really excited. Um, I love these type of games that have you know sort of that lore based thing in it but it's not just throwing it in your face constantly with like the, the over the top but the really good character building almost like you're sitting in a movie theater in your own little movie because you're controlling it. and But at the same time, you get to really get the sense of how these characters interact with each other and how they interact with the environment around them. So yeah, I'm, re I'm really excited. I hope you guys are. Let's go ahead and get right into this. All right, so we're opening up with In the Year Granddad Died, The Highway Extension Came, The Road Through Possum Springs Had Been the Only Way to the State Park, The Highway Took the Traffic But Gave Us Donut Wolf, Granddad left me in an apple crate of books. He loved ghost stories and quoted them to himself in the hospital bed. They feared death, so they ate the young. On his last day, he sat up suddenly and stared bug-eyed through the window at the old playground. Half washed away, he turned to my dad. Eyes still wide, this house is haunted, he said, and died. Wow. Uh, we got a lot happening on that first dialogue there. Oh, that's awesome. Well, this is great. I mean, I didn't expect a party or anything, but I figured someone would be here. That art style is incredible. Welcome home, May. Oh, so we can move around now. Look at that little slide animation. That's so amazing. Okay, so it looks like we're in a school. Oh, we've got this bird dude. Excuse me, but where is everyone? It's 1045. It's closed. Not a lot of folks getting off the last bus to Possum Springs these days. Just you. I, I'm wrong three times in a row. Now it's it's the bus station. I get it. Isn't there supposed to be someone at the desk? Closed. Why are the lights on? Why is the TV on? I get spooked when I'm here by, by my lonesome. Wow. It sounds like there's people over there, bud. Uh oh. Okay, so we've got with that guy. And we can already jump. Oh, we've already got some things we can move around and look at. Wow, when did they put this up? Possum Springs has never looked more falsely advertised. Already, guys, this the character building's already begun. It's like dialogue, but it's you can tell it's been written with care. You know, like these interactions are so well done. Let's see what we've got here. It must be such a relief to payphone companies that Possum Springs gets zero cell reception. It'd be cool to call my parents, but some jerk hole took the time to actually rip it off. Who steals a phone? Fiasco Fox, you are too dreamy. Fiasco Fox, see, this art style is like something straight out of a storybook. It's amazing. Can I squeeze past you? Nope, just broke the damn thing. When do you think it might be done? Right after you go grab me a Fiesca Cola from the machine. I was just over there, man. Am I paying for this? I always rig it when I'm here after hours. Nice. Free as in free. Free as in no one's here to say otherwise. Perfect. That dude looks like the pigeon. Uh, don't let the pigeon drive the bus. That's who that guy looks like. He looks like he's gone through some rough times, and now the pigeon who wasn't allowed to drive the bus is now a contractor. What the? They have lime fiasco, and he wants a fiascola? That's just a waste. Oh, here it comes. Oh, that is so cool. You get to actually move his... You actually get to move his little head to grab it. Oh, missed it. Missed it. Grab it. There we go. That's awesome. I'm I'm in love with this game already. That's amazing. All right, we got your fiasco cola, bud. Now can we get by you? One free ass cola. <laughs> Oh, well, that's one way to do it. Yummers. So what are you doing here? I live here. Well, lived here. Huh? Strange. When do you think that door's going to be finished? Now. And even the little ticks that the characters do, like you saw the cat twitch his ear, and he's got his little... The, even the movement of the the goatee he's got going there, it's just... it's It's all just those tiny details are amazing. Oh, he just left. Oh, it's dark in here now. Oh, I guess we should go after him. Looks like the door's fixed now. Not to worry. Oh. Well, I'm right outside, outside town. Mom and Dad nowhere to be found. Dark and cold. Guess I'm walking. Alone. Oh, that's sad. And the street, there's the fireflies under the street lamps. Wow. I didn't realize how much I missed the sound of that train. I used to hear it in my bed at night. During the winter when the leaves were down. Oh, there was no more. Okay. 
That's cool. They actually threw the train back there. Well, I guess I'm going to hike through the woods. Through the woods is home. My bed. And my negligent parents. This guy's living pretty sad right now. He, he seems pretty depressed about his current situation. Oh, we're going. What do we have here? There's some... Looks like some graffiti. And that four... Oh, I didn't... I was meaning to look at those, but... We got a plastic bag and a tree. Oh, this is some dank nature. Dank nature and garbage. <laughs> dank nature. That's amazing. Oh, there's an old abandoned bike. There's some carved names. There's some glass that they were talking about. I know he said there was a glass factory. Here comes the platforming part. Oh, you're out on... Whoa. Oh, wow. I saw the screen start to shake a little bit more, but I didn't know that would happen. Is he okay? Oh my god, that was dangerous. I could have died. That was amazing. I'm not gonna die in this hole. Shopping bags are little ghosts of grocery stores, haunting everywhere else. That's a pretty deep metaphorical thing to say, my friend. Oh, he just made a sound. Wow, what are those lights off in the distance? Oh, that's cool. There's one little red leaf. Oh, there's more than one. Okay, well, I thought it was cool. I thought all of it was going to be in black and white, and there was going to be one little red leaf. Oh, there's some different colored ones, too. I feel like some, like, old grandma looking at all these. The one thing I'm interested in is the leaves as we're passing. Like, who in the world says that? Okay. I don't know what they were going for here. Some sort of boat castle? Most of it's gone now. Just the thing for weird animals to eat and have babies in. This dude's, like, very observant, observant and... I don't know. He, he's got a lot of uh, metaphorical things to say about his surroundings. Ahoy. He's so childlike and playful, though. It's amazing. Looks like the ladder's gone. If I could just get to the top of this thing. Oh, he's checking it out. I could never make it up onto that tree when I was a kid. The number logs mocked me. The logs and the other kids. Oh, that's sad. Let me see if I can visualize this. Oh, yeah, you can make that, bud. Let's Let's prove them wrong now. Can't stop running while I do this. Not even for a second. Gotta have enough momentum. I think I can do it. Run and jump, jump, jump. Oh, man. He's about to prove so many people wrong right here. Let's see. Oh, he did it. Oh, and you even got a little jump boost there at the end. That's pretty cool. It's only been two years since I lived here. Not in this playground. Possum Springs, I mean. This is all getting jumbled. I should write it down. Oh, that's so cool. R.I.P. Granddad... He wrote the name May again. That's that's they said that in the bus station, I think. And your fair, your parents forgot you. Oh, that's sad. There's a little octopus. Oh, okay. And this is how we get to our options. So can we slide down this thing? Oh, you could tightrope. Yeah. Tight tightrope walk. There we go. That's what I was looking for. Oh. Hello, May. Been oh, May's his name. Her name. Her name, I think. Been a while. Hey, what are you doing out here? Nothing better to do? I was out here doing my rounds, and I saw you in the very off-limits playground. So, get in the car, May. No. You want to spend your first night back in jail, May? No. <laughs> the dialogue is so good so far. Oh, uh, is that Papa May? Bless this mess. <laughs> We've got the classic thing on here. Oh, here comes the walk of shame. Hey, remember me? Ah, May, you gave me a heart attack. Good. What are you doing? Oh, no. Oh, May, honey, we thought you were coming tomorrow night. You thought wrong. How did you get here? I walked until I got arrested by Aunt Mall Cop. Oh, did you say hi to Molly for me? No, I said hi to no one. F the cops. I'm going to bed. Is my bed still here? Or are we waiting for tomorrow night for that too? Ah, May. So good to hear that voice again. Good night. See, what's funny is that May is obviously very upset. And the dad, both their faces just stay the same. It's that, like, just oblivious look. It's, oh, that was... This is... Let's see what we got over here. I have no words to describe it. I tried. There are a few things hanging around in here from the old country. This clock, the trunk, and the storage room. And whatever is buried under the house after the cement incident. I want to know more about the cement incident all of a sudden. What do we have here? Oh, I should have checked that out. I probably can't get... Oh, no, you can get back. Okay. Uh, since when is the crawl space all jammed up? 
wonder if dad could move them. I've got a little bird nightlight. Can I not jump across this? Oh, there we go. But there's nothing to get into over here yet. And that looks like a bird cage. See, <laughs> look at the pictures. The pictures are all just the same face. That's that's perfectly describes cats, though. You know that everything they do, whether they're they're angry, they're hungry, they've always got that same face on. That's hilarious. Oh, he's stretching out, taking off his he or she. I don't know if it's he or she yet. I'd assume it's a she with May, but you never know. It's cat. Oh, rise and shine. Bright and early. Oh, and his hair is crinkled up. His or her hair is crinkled up. I'd assume it's a her. Oh, am I supposed to wake her up? Oh, I was. Okay. Yep, scratch it out. Get those boots back on there. Let's take a look around your room. You're a musician. I see. Could play some bass. But which song? Nah, later. Space Dragon. All, I know, all she knows is Space Dragon. Let's do it. Wanderer in space, no matter forbidden place. Oh, oh, okay. Uh, gotta play some bass now. This is the worst bass. This is so cool, though. They've added so many elements. I thought I was doing good. I am not. Looks like you're a little rusty, May. You need to practice up on your bass skills a little bit here. <laughs> you're not a... Not doing so hot. You forgot how the, the space song goes. Oh, no. Oh, there's constantly... I'm trying to watch the screen over there and at the same time do this guitar hero. Sorry, parrots, that this terrible bass is coming from upstairs at 6 in the morning. I wonder how long all this artwork took, though. I had to have taken a while because there's so much. There we go. We played that horrendous song. We got majority of the notes right, but he's definitely not just a, a pro bassist. There we go. I thought that maybe it was going to be endless for a second. I literally do not know this song <laughs> yet. Okay, I'm sorry. May, I'm sure you're a, a great bassist back in the day, but you definitely need to brush up on those skills. This thing goes off randomly every month. Little wooden duck pops out, makes the weirdest sound. Scares Dad half to death every time. Used to joke it was Granddad getting even with him from beyond the grave. All this reference to granddad is going to be important, I have a feeling. Ooh, let's see. There's the bird. How is this bird still alive? Uh, i just like to point out that there's a pet bird in a house full of cats. That's pretty great. It was pretty great when granddad gave me that apple crate of old scary stories. Not sure how they ended up out here. Death comes to Wigglesbury. The fancy corpse. Helmore Stevenson. Necropus Book the First. Lady Shark. <laughs> the Stoat on Gallows Hill. Those are probably going to be interesting, or those are probably going to be important at some point. Honey? Yeah? Come see me in the kitchen before you leave. Okay. We got to go see. I got to assume. Yep, there's Mama May. Mama Borowski. Hi, Mom. Welcome home, sweetie. Thanks for not changing the locks. <laughs> wow, he's just, she's just roasting her parents right now. Sorry you mixed up the day you were coming back. It was such short notice. It's okay, Mom. May, honey? Yeah? Is everything okay? Uh, yeah, let's 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 just go with the simple answer. Yeah, Mom, things are good. You know, we don't want to complicate things. We got stuff to do. May's got stuff to do. Well, I mean, it was a bit alarming to your father and I when you called. I assumed that something was very wrong. No, it just didn't work out at school. What does that mean, honey? Can we talk about this another time? Sure, hon. Thanks, Mom. I bet your old friend will be happy to see you. You wouldn't happen to know where Greg is, would you? Oh yeah, Greg's working down at the Snack Falcon. That's the coolest name for a convenience store, I'm guessing. Up in Town Center West by the Click Clack. Let's see. I think I'll run over and say hey. We'll have a good time out there. Lots to explore, see what's changed. I will. Just watch out for all the construction. Well, it wouldn't... Well, it wouldn't be Fallen Possum Springs without... A... Well, it wouldn't be Fallen Possum Springs without the loads of construction. Oh, what? I'm such an idiot. It's talking about the season fall. What in the world? That that was just like perplexing me. It's so festive, honey. I'll be back later. Bye, sweetie. Okay, so now we know that May is a boarding school student because she's back. But we don't know why she's back. Home again, part one. This game is amazing so far. Just this little introductory uh, sequence has been great.
Kill, kill, kill. FBI freeze. Wow. Uh, okay, there's a squirrel. It's cool they have the cars going by. Oh, here's the construction. Well, it sure is fall. All the road work crammed in before winter. Makes like half the town inaccessible. Unless you want to walk the long way around for like 20 minutes. Which I mean, no. Hey, Mr. Twigmire. May? Is that you? <laughs> you can just go, nope. That would confuse him. That would thoroughly confuse him, I'm sure. You home for a visit? No, I'm home for good. Wait, they not have college? Ah, oh, college. May's older than I thought. They not have college anymore? Let's let's go with it burned down. That's a better story. Well, I'm sure you burned it down. These allegations, Mr. Twigmire. I ain't alligating. Just trying not to burn my lawn down, you firebug. No promises. Okay, I thought he had like a German accent at first with the zat, but that was that was definitely some southern twang there at the end. So now I'm throwing for a loop about Mr. Twigmire. Let's see what this guy's... Selmers, what are you doing home? Dropped out. Wow. Yeah, I guess. So, like, you just don't go back? That's about it. Weird. <laughs> See, oh, is that the son of a uh, pigeon? Hello. What you doing on my porch? Oh, that's it. Okay. Hey, Mr. Chaskow. Hello, May, my best to worst student. Haha, <laughs> yeah. Liked the constellations. Hated school. Hey, don't knock school. School is for vital for your future. What are you doing back in Possum Springs? I dropped out of school. Oh, <laughs> oh well, there there goes that idea. Well, if you're still interested in constellations, come by my roof down the hill later this week. Should have my new telescope set up by then. Sure thing. That, I have a feeling, is going to be awesome. I think I can use that power line, but I'm going to keep walking this way. Danny, right? Yep. I think you were a senior when I was a freshman. Probably. How's it going? Just lost my job. Oh, no. They say construction's always hiring. But it's not. In fact, it's often often laying off guys named Dan. What are you going to do? I'm open to suggestions. Let's see. Oh, that's so passive aggressive. I'm sure someone in town is hiring. Let's just give him a good don't give up. Well, there's always a chance someone will die. But, uh, wow. You know, that's not how job search goes, but best of luck. And I could have their job. Dan, you're not going to, like, kill anyone, are you? Does it pay? We're just going to leave Danny, good old Danny, with, with that town center platform. Oh, we can go in through there. I guess we'll do that first. Why not? It came up first. We'll just do whatever comes up first, I guess. Oh. They nailed, like, the underground sound. Like, there's a dude vigorously flipping some pierogies, I guess. Let's see what this guy's got to say. Hey, I just got back in town, and the one thing I missed most was... Hey, I remember you. Hello. Thief. Oh, come on. That was years ago. Once a thief, always a thief. All right, you know what? Oh, man, we could get... Oh, look, May's angry. Let's see. Oh, man, both of these are bad. I don't want to insult his profession, so we'll just go with this. You don't want to, You don't really want... We're only, what? Yeah, 25 minutes into this game. We don't want to insult people's professions already or their, their businesses. I've stolen from better places than this. I wouldn't lower myself to steal from here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go jump in the river. It's, all right. Well, I mean, we we did ask him to vigorously. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's not going to let me steal it? I would try to, but it's not going to let me. You know, <laughs> that would be so funny. It's like, hey, I'm not a thief. Take that back and then just swipe a pretzel from him. Let's see what this guy's. Oh, these are some hoodlums. These little hoodlums here, I'm sure. Hey, teens. Hey, what are you guys doing? Oh, nothing. Cool. Cool that people still hang around down here. We used to do that when I was in high school. Yeah. I wasn't in high school that long ago, you know. How old are you? 20. Oh, so you can't buy beer? No. Do you have a car? No. Hmm. And <laughs> that's it. They're nailing these interactions so far. Oh, we missed quite a bit. There's another. What? Are you, what in the world? A cat on all fours, a pet cat in a, this is, okay, I'm going to try and comprehend this. It's a cat, a pet cat walking around in a town of animal p 
people. Okay, I'm not even going to think about that too long. We got the Social Security Administration with another bird on top. And that cat's still going. Oh, we've got some more probably teenagers up here. I'm doing all the dialogue. I don't know if that's annoying or not, but I like reading what they or hearing what they have to say. It's almost five. Quitting time. Kick back some brews and watch the smelters at Miller's. Let's see. Oh, we made it to the Snack Falcon. Look at that. They nailed it. Like the AC on top of the convenience store. That's just like a small detail that they didn't have to, like, they nailed that. That's amazing. We made it in the Snack Falcon. We got some Carl's Crunched or Angry Pepper and original. Oh, is this the guy? Oh, my God. Hey, Greg. What are you doing here? I'm back. Like, back as in today? Back as in back. Too bad you didn't die at college. Too bad you didn't catch a flesh-eating disease. Too bad you didn't join a murder cult. Too bad you didn't lose all your limbs in a freak soda machine accident. God, it's good to see you. <laughs> just, wow, that's some, some enthusiasm. <laughs> Look at those arms go. How's Angus? You two still a thing? Hold on. Oh, is he bringing Angus out? What are you doing? Changing the music. Oh, did he just change the subject? I'm feeling a little bit of a uh, tension there in that subject. What? Angus, what are you doing here? Whoa. Yeah, there's definitely some uh, some built up <laughs> something baggage about that question. I live here. Since when? Since last night, 11 or so. That's amazing. Come to band practice. Oh my God, the band is still a thing? Sure. When's practice? Now. When do you get off work? Now. Really? This dude seems to be making up his own rules here. Another scream. I, I want to know more about this Angus thing. He's definitely hiding something from us about that. Oh, there. He, oh, we're at band practice now. Hi, Angus. Hey, it's you. It's May. It's May. <laughs> this dude or girl is so excited all the time. And that arm flap thing is like, it's mesmerizing. You can just watch his arms go back and forth over and over. So the party barn went out, huh? Yeah, not sure how it ever stayed open. Like, how many parties are there really? You need a lot of parties to keep a barn running. Have your old bass. Oh, no, not this. I, I think you... No, you don't really want me to play bass. I'm, I I think that's a mistake. I'm not really all I'm cracked up to be and not as good as, I'd, as I was in the good old days back then. Oh, dude, I don't think I even remember. Hey, B, uh, May's back. Oh, no. Wow, hi. Yeah, hi. She's totally back. Wait, what? Are you uh here for band practice? I play drums. That's not drums. That's computer. Oh, no, we're getting some classic musician rage here. It's fine. She also does your bass parts. Well, I understood them as the bass parts, but I can turn them off. Hey, no, no, you can't just take my place. Okay, no, hand, hand me the bass. Go ahead. We're going to try this again. Turn them off on your computer. May, we're totally going to play a song. You totally had to play. <laughs> that dude is just the overwhelming optimist. I like his character so far. I don't even remember. Those aren't even drums. Oh, no, we're doing another music sequence, but it's all of us. Here we go. We're going to try this again. Yeah, could your computer do these? Oh, no, I just I spoke too soon. I'm not going to brag again because that made me mess up last time. I really want to know what's going on on the screens, though. But I have to focus on this damn bass. Wow, we're not doing so well. There's definitely no forgiveness on these notes. If you miss it, it's just going to rattle your brains. <laughs> it's so, like, unsatisfying to hit it because it just, ah, uh, like that. It's just the entire screen shakes and everything just so unsettling because you're so used to this game being, like, so relaxed and it just goes so unsettling so fast. I don't even know how I'm doing that, and I'm not doing it. That's fine. That was pretty cool. All the hard parts I nail, it's all these tiny little spaced out things. Also, it's not just if you hit the note, it sounds good. Like, there's actually some rhythm in this. Because it still doesn't sound right if I hit them all. Uh, like, if I just make them, it doesn't sound right. It's like you have to nail them perfectly to actually get the 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 uh, the song part of it. Like, the melody. But hopefully we'll get better at this as it goes on. Pretty good. Yeah, that was okay. Yeah, screw you. Not bad considering I don't know this song. Holy crap. That was hard to do. Yeah, no kidding. I wonder if those change, though. 
Like now I'm wondering if I just nailed that first base part that we did back at the apartment, if maybe she would have had a different reaction. And if I had actually nailed that one, maybe she would have been more confident. I don't know. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe I'm, I'm looking too far into this, but that'd be really cool. You'll go back and practice. I hope. Jeez. My wrist hurts. That was great, man. Like just seeing you back playing your old horrible bass. Okay. We're doing this diner thing. Yeah. Woo. Yay. Hip, hip. <laughs> what is the diner thing? I don't think we know what this is. Oh, I thought you meant like we're playing music at a diner. No, it's just we're going to a diner together. Hell yeah. Did you miss Pizza May? They have pizza at school. Oh, cool. Oh, I get to grab some. Get some. Oh, man. I just grabbed it straight by the middle. Oh, did you really? You left the crust? Like, what? who does that, man? Who puts the crust back on everybody's pizza? That's not what you do. Pizza isn't great. It's pretty horrible. Dudes, haven't you heard of the pizza scale? Uh, screw it, pizza good. That's basically the pizza scale. He's explained it to me several times. That's about it. Pizza good. Oh, I need another one. Let's just, let's actually grab it like a normal. No, I, I see that guy scrounging around for one. He's going to be left with that one. Sorry, man. I mean, it's no, oh, wow. He didn't even get one. That poor guy didn't even get one. I mean, it's no possibilities. Mm, I missed possibilities. I am not touching those crusts. Same. We should have gone to possibilities. The diner has ambiance. The seats are comfy. The food is terrible, but it's got charm. You too fancy for the diner now? Guys, please. I was raised in this diner. You and like a zillion rats. You know, this. This is, there's some definite aggression coming from across the table over there. I'm not I'm not sure what we did to get off on the wrong foot, but that's that's not working out. So when are we gonna play out? No look at that. Just nobody asked for that. No, I didn't ask for that. And she's she's got a cigarette going. May, we don't play out. Oh. We have jobs, May. I work at the video outpost too. I'm at that I'm at the old pickaxe. Thought you were going to school. Isn't that your dad's store? Let's go with that. Heh, yeah, well, life happens. Do you hear that banging sound he's making on the table? Wow, I'm the lord of the snack falcons. Where's Casey? Oh yeah, you wouldn't know, huh? Casey's gone. Gone? Gone how? Hopped a train, I bet. Oh wow, he's always talked about doing that. Yeah, one day he was just gone. Made a clean break, hasn't emailed or anything. Well, good for him, I guess. His parents put up missing person posters, but everyone knew what happened. Jeez, Casey, I, uh... Mm-hmm. And what exactly did you do, May? I was in college? And why exactly are you not still there? Oh, wow. Let's just go with didn't work out. Huh, imagine that. Wow. See, that? what? what is that? Well, we better get home, dude. <laughs> nice way to change the subject. Just icebreaker right there. Oh, yeah, Angus got a date with sword people online. Angus got a date with sword people online. That's not... Uh, let's hope that clears up. Oh, lucky. It's really great to be back. Dude, we can hang out every day. Oh, my God. Holy crap. What? Is that an arm? That's an arm. Nobody move. Let's poke it with a stick. I call first. Oh, are we can't... Is there going to be a thing? There is. May, this is like tampering with evidence. Ugh, I'm going to have to start worrying about getting dismembered on my way home. Shh, I want to watch it. I want to watch this. You don't need your ears to watch. Shh. Oh, I've got the stick ready. Let's poke this thing. Oh, poking it. Give it a good poke. Oh, there's a tattoo on there. Whoa, what's that? Oh, there's a roach. Some kind of mark. What? Is that a tattoo? That's a tattoo. What is it? I think you just slipped out a clue, dude. Oh, for F's sake, you two. Here come the cops. Now what's going on here? Uh-oh. Oh, it was the cops saying, now what's going on here? Now what's going on here? I get it now. Hey, Aunt Molly, we found an arm. All right, May, put the stick down and step away from the arm. All right, all right, don't taser me or anything. No promises. Oh, well, I think it's time for Angus and I to get home. See you tomorrow, May. All right, I don't want any of you walking home alone tonight. Buddy system, something bad's going on. Oh, no. Yep, I knew it was going to lead me with whatever her name is. Thank you, B. B, there it is. Okay, we're left with B. 
Yeah, thanks, B. Let's roll. Oh, we're in the car now. So that translates to how we're traveling. Oh, that is the coolest shot ever. How are you seeing the road? You're staring. You got like the Peppa Pig thing going on. So, working at the old pickaxe. Yep. Are they training you to take over the family business? They? Um, your parents? Uh-oh. Hey, look, we're here. Oh, my house actually isn't for a few blocks. Get out. Okay, uh, thanks for the ride. Go. Man, touchy subjects all around. You can't mention anything around good old B about her getting mad. Oh, we're back. Oh, we got something. Let's see. We got some more stuff. So we've got Greg rules. Okay. Die anywhere else. Oh, I, I think that's the name of the song that we played. Gregor's Pizza Scale. Too fancy. Good as hell. Greg rules. Okay. Avoid. Arm. <laughs> he just drew the severed arm. Observation. Chopped? No, it's severed. There we go. That's a better word. Army jacket on the sidewalk with the roach. Yeah, that's an eventful day. But we tell dad about it. Hey, kitten. Rower. Listen, man. I'm sorry about last night. I really thought you were coming home tonight. Let's just go with it. I, I don't want to start anything with the, the parents yet about them missing it. It is kind of a big deal, I mean, but we'll just get over it. We went through the ravine by the old mill. Almost died. What? Yeah, logs almost killed me. Normal stuff. Well, I promise you I'll never leave you stranded again. Tell you what, how about we pretend I did come home tonight, and we just got back from the bus station. Start over? Yeah. Okay. Hey, Dad. Hey, May. Thanks for picking me up. Welcome home, May. I'm going to go to sleep, I think. We've had a big day. Good night, kitten. See, that's that's what I want to do. I don't want to, like, screw with all the relationships just yet. Also, could you... Okay, so, cat clock in a, in a house where cats live. Could you imagine having a human face clock in your house? That would be so scary. I mean, that would not be okay. That would be unacceptable. All right, so we made it back. Bedtime? Okay, so you actually get to... Can't live in bed, May. Oh, no, we can play more music. We're not going to play anymore. Two music two music things in one day is good. So with that, guys, at the end of this day, I think I'm going to end this video here. I My first impression on this game is I'm thoroughly enjoying it. I really love this art style, the characters so far. The story is incredible, just the way it captures, like, adolescence, you know, and that, that time, or not even adolescence. It's It's got an adolescence feel, but it's definitely... In some way, I mean, I know May's 20 years old, but it captures that, like, spirit of freedom once again. I think that's sort of what's coming out in the game a little bit. And one of the themes of the game is going to be coming back from the stressful college life and, you know, rediscovering your childhood freedom and all your childhood friends and all your hobbies and activities and just being able to get lost in adventure and stuff like that. And I think that's amazing. So as far as this game, I love it. I would definitely recommend it. Um, definitely going to keep playing through it on here. We're going to just play through the whole game, however long that takes. Um, I'm not sure how long exactly it is, but I've got all kinds of stuff lined up for y'all. Um, all kinds of games laid out. I've got four or five games to kind of alternate between. Um, between now and then, you know, I'll focus more on this game, but I've got some other ones that I'll definitely try and split time with, so it's not just throwing them all out at one time. But if you have any suggestions, definitely feel free go to my about page hit me up in the email section where you've revealed the business email you can join the discord of course the link is up in my it's in my about page and also up on the banner of my channel i'd love to chat with you guys about anything really the game anything like that you can just come chat with me but yeah as i'm just going to leave y'all with that um thank you guys so much for watching and taking time out of your day if you did enjoy it i'd appreciate you know uh, a like would really help me out uh likes and, sub and subscribe if you want to see more content like this and more playthroughs if you can stand me reading all the the dialogue between the characters i just love reading it i love to see what the the writers come up with and yeah feel free to leave some comments on the videos down there. Let me know what you guys think. Is there something that I could change to make it more enjoyable? Uh, do you like me reading all the audio or the dialogue or anything like that? Any suggestions you have, any comments you have, anything you want to talk about uh, with the videos or the game at all, just drop them down there and I'll get right back to you. So guys, let's leave it here. I'll see you guys in the next video. Remember, don't settle for shallow.